Hey guys, it's Nick from Retro Games HQ, and today I am talking about Anatons Kickstarter, which Anatons is an open world monster collecting RPG, as it says, and it takes some of its um, inspiration from Ark, if you know anything about that. So here's what I plan to do I plan to play on the video, depending on how long it is, um, and then I'm going to read a little bit of this Kickstarter page and then go through the pledges. And for those that want to stick around, I'm going to read the rest of the Kickstarter page. So, let's go ahead and start the video. Okay, there's the video. So as you can tell, you know, it's obviously got battling, but if you've seen, there's anatons that were not just battling. You know? It, you Did you see? You could actually, there was one that was like charging something. There was one that was watering. Of course, in the subtitle, as you can see, it's collect anatons, fight wild ones in real-time battles, and get lost in this open-world sandbox RPG, so it's pretty open to what you can do. So I'm going to read a little bit. Take a look at Anatons' early gameplay footage. Anatons is an open-world monster collecting RPG. It's our dream game and would be more than pleased to deliver, uh, deliver it to you. We, as monster-taming genre fans, want to make something unique and never seen before. Take a look at Anatons' early gameplay footage. So let's see if this is a different video. And I'm not going to play the hey, whole thing. Hey, how's it going, everyone? Today, I have the privilege of breaking down some very early pre-alpha Anatons gameplay footage. Now, we start out in the wilderness with our mentors, and we make our way towards this open area with a Stegarion that's looking for a fight. So what's going to happen is this little robot's going to call, uh, call mentors back, and out comes Explino, since he can only control one Anaton at a time. As you can see, the combat system revolves around an over-the-shoulder display with Explino focusing on fire-based projectiles. Each Anaton has a different playstyle and the types will reflect this. Now, as you can see, Stegarion goes for the Rock Shield as it's a hybrid nature and rock type, but eventually we get the better of it with our exploding blast of, uh, death. After defeating the Anaton, we use our robot to defeat it and obtain some DNA, which, when enough is incurred, we can create our own Anaton of the same evolutionary line. Next up, we're going to hop back on Mentors and head over to the Crystal Cave. Now, as you can see to the right, there is a magnetic rock formation that attracts electric types such as the Elatigs you see here. Different areas and Anatons will attract different types, so always keep your eyes open. Alright, so obviously there's more uh, to it, but for sake of brevity for this first part, I'm going to uh, wait on that. And once I get through, you know, okay, here, I'm going to come back to this when I'm done with the pledges. So let's get through this. But so far, it looks pretty interesting. You know, so there's a real time, you know, it's not a turn-based thing. Uh, I'm sure, you know, I mean, it looks super interesting just because you get to use the monsters or anatons as, you know, you can actually control them. Instead of just being like, okay, put in this move. Okay, he's going to attack with this move. Stuff like that. 
So let's keep going. Anatons is an open world monster collecting RPG where you start your adventure in the wilderness, fight wild anatons, and collect your own unique anatons. Every uh, every anaton you obtain can help you fight and farm. Expand your base to fit all monsters in your collection. Decorate walls and place bamboo sticks to make pangaros feel at home. Happy and well-fed anaton will feel better and help you gather resources. Catch every known anaton, battle other players, build the biggest farm, or just get lost in the world full of life. So let's go ahead and look at their goals real fast. So their first goal is 75000 and that's if they get funded. So the project is funded, we can extend our team, finish the game, we need the help of a publisher. Then they have Steam. So 100,000 pet mechanics, pet and play with uh, with your anatons, teach them special tricks, prepare their uh, favorite food. 140,000 boss fights, encounter rare and powerful pure form bosses, create pure form anatons, I wonder what that is. Upgrade skills of your favorite anatons, dynamic events, dynamic weather system, random events like base invasion by wild anatons. Oh, hmm. Seasonal events with unique rewards. 210,000. Invite multiple other players to join your game. Play in co-op with your friends while fighting and building. Fight in a duel in, uh, in PvP mode. I hope to God that gets funded all the way to that. Because multiplayer can expand that so much. Um, you can have a much longer lasting game with multiplayer, honestly. You know, because this is a single player game, but tax on multiplayer, and I like that. Uh, 240,000 raids. Battle in raids with your friends. Fight powerful Anatons as bosses. Collect rare items for your Anatons. New Vulcan and Island regions. Oh, hmm. Huge new regions. Oh, huge. Uh, volcanic wasteland and tropical islands. 22 an uh, new anatons to encounter. Oh, that's actually pretty freaking significant. On top of the new regions, just for 40,000, that's pretty significant. Fly and swim on your noble anatons to travel faster. Face fire and water anaton champion. Honestly, for 40,000, that is a lot. You get for 40... Uh, I mean, honestly, for 40,000 more from raids, that is a lot. Two new huge areas, 22 new anatons, fly and swim, and a uh, face fire and water anaton champion. That, that's huge. Uh, 310,000 console for PS4, PS5, Xbox One, um, and Xbox Series. All right. So, Taiga region, new region Taiga. My God. Um, meet 12 new anatons. Use fire anatons to heat the base. Face Ice Type Anaton Champion, Lore Elevation, Massive Main Storyline Extension, New Story Characters and Locations, uh, New Side Quests and Background Stories for Anatons, Three New Legendary Anatons to Collect, New Region for Swamp Region, With Toxic Type Anatons, Meet 15 New Anatons, My God, uh, Face Toxic Type Anaton Champion, For 30,000 more at 480, Play Anatons on Nintendo Switch, Now I... If he can get to there, I think that's significant. Yes, PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series is, is significant. But I feel like Nintendo Switch has been catering... Uh, the, the monster taming genre games, I feel like, just like uh, well, a few others, are coming out on Nintendo Switch. So I think that's the freaking platform to go to. Desert Region. New Desert Region. Uh, with Rock-type Anatons. 15 new Anatons. Rock-type Anaton Champion. Caves and Jungle, 15 new Anatons. My god. Uh, face Crystal and Wind Anaton Champion. So we're getting some types as we're going along as well. Like Rock Anatons, Toxic Anatons, Crystal, Wind Anatons. Upcoming, we will announce more goals once we hit 400k. Such as dedicated servers with over 100 players per region. Okay, they need to hit that. That's gigantic. Modding tools that let you create your own Anatons. What? Worldwide ranking, that's some cool crap. <laughs> no, that's actually freaking awesome. What the heck? Uh, so I'm going to read a few of the features. I'm going to get to the tiers. And for you all that are more interested, I'm going to be reading the rest, showing the rest of that video and all that. So explore a vast open world where you can find wild anatons and useful resources. At first, getting uh, by uh, in the wilderness will not be an easy task. But as you collect and evolve more powerful anatons, you will find... A way to be invincible. Dynamic combat system. Control your anatons in real-time world combat. Uh, and use various skills you've taught them during a fight. It's not only strategy that plays a role, but also agility and accuracy. Fighting with wild anatons won't always be a fair fight. Prepare to face dozens of enemies at once. Oh. Man, it was. Hmm. Evolution and creation. Evolve anim uh, anatons. Acquire new moves. Breed a completely new one. 
To do this, you need DNA points. You obtain these by either farming these specific type of anaton or by fighting them in the wild. Forge your own path. Multiplayer. Invite uh, multiple friends and play together. You can team up to fight anaton hordes or raid or on raids. I guess it means or raids. I don't know. Or build a new base with your friends. Use PvP duels to fight other players and test new tactics. Offline mode will, of course, still be an option for those who want to play solo. So this link is uh, this features link to the multiplayer stretch goal. So hopefully you all can get it to there. Um, let's see, sandbox. Found your own base using resources you obtain from the wild. There you can keep your, all your anatons and make them feel at home. You can not only place buildings, but also customize the environment around you. Create a cozy new place for you and your anatons to rest after a tough fight. Uh, what's happening? Uh, <laughs> farming uh, various uh, or farm various monsters and resources that will uh, you will find useful throughout your journey. Each type of anaton prefers a different kind of food. Well, fed Anton will use his unique ability that will aid you in this aspect. Electric types can charge machines that will automate your work. Fire types can heat your house, and water types can help grow your crops. So you can customize your character, perfectly fit, playstyle on Anaton squad, new, unlock new outfits as you progress. Also, build your mansion, paint walls, hang pictures of your friends and favorite Anatons. So it's a community-driven uh, development. Since the beginning of this development, um, we've been transparent with our goals and development process, and we'll keep going on this until the full release. We organized a couple contests where fans could create their own anatons or name existing ones. Um, so I guess these are a few of the community ones, which the top one looks cool. Bottom right looks cool. It looks like um, Enter the Dungeon or whatever, That's that kind of thing. Bomb left, I love that little thing. Oh, I love the color green. Top left, I mean bottom left thing, Kraken, Purikin, Saken looks pretty cool. And then Skullub and Skullbeer. That's really cool. So before I go to more on, you know, about the story and stuff, let's go ahead and go through these uh, mode tiers, pledge tiers. So pledge without ward, do it. Follower, so it's just uh, backer exclusive progress, high res digital wallpaper. It's May delivery, May twenty, uh, May twenty twenty one. Supporter, fifteen bucks or more. Receive a digital copy of Anaton's official soundtrack. The pledge includes official soundtrack, uh, exclusive access to progress board, digital wallpaper, backer exclusive progress. Um, so then you become at thirty eight backer. Now a backer receive a digital copy of the game on PC or console as an exclusive Kickstarter outfit to your character. So it includes everything from the previous awards, uh, uh, tier each other, and it's digital game, Steam, Windows, or console if stretch goals met, and backer's outfit and cosmetic, and the in-game title, backer tier. You have, of course, remember guys, this literally just went up. So, if you're just seeing three backers, or down here four backers, yeah, it, it just went up. But pledge US 40, uh, 40, USD 45 or more, uh, you'll receive exclusive access to closed beta release, Steam only. You'll be able to start building your Anaton collection sooner before the full release, including all rewards from previous tiers. So it's a closed beta access tier uh, key, and you get Explore in the in-game uh, title, or an in -game, as an in-game title. You also have, this is a limited discount, so pledge $50 or more for the champion early bird. She's one of our starter set, a cute handmade plushie. So you freaking get a plushie and a unique matching outfit. Uh, one of so that's what you get plus everything before it ships to anywhere in the world. Right now it's 14 backers, so it's super popular. You better get it. As is, you know, maybe there's only 100, but it just started. So for something that just started, already having 14, you need to get on it if you're going to get it. Because if not, then you're going to have to pay what about 20 bucks more. Yep, for that tier. If you don't get the early bird. So pledge $100 or more, you get patronage. Your name will be visible in the game's credits, and you'll gain access to Anaton's closed alpha. You receive an exclusive art book, uh, a digital art book, and unique digital game compendium. Uh, man. Also, everything from the previous uh, rewards, or tiers, rather. Pledge 150 or more, Pure Trainer. Begin your adventure with rare and powerful Pure Form Starter. You also get the end game title, An Analyst. Okay. And everything before. Or you can... Or... So here's the thing, guys. If you think, man, I want that pure trainer. Check out the ancient trainer early bird. There's only... There's 92 left, but still. Just started. Don't take that for granted. 
you get the Ancient Trainer Early Bird. So check this out before you get the one above it, because this is going to get you more for the same amount. Receive an exclusive Kickstarter only and Anaton. What? And a matching champion outfit. Now's the only time to get this Anaton, other than trading with a friend. You also get the Ancient Trainer in game title and everything that comes before. And if you don't get that as an early bird, it's 200. You also get Nobleman. Don't want to choose? Receive all three starter sets, three times acute handmade plushies, and unique matching outfits. Includes all rewards from the previous tier. Now you also get Celebrity if you use $300 or more. Get your name into the game. Choose your nickname and find it either in the lore or visible on a grave, street, building, etc. You can choose how you want to be known to all other players. It includes all rewards from previous. Now there's already somebody that's got that. So, of course you can get it too. It's just, there's already one backer for it. Taylor, design a whole cosmetic outfit for your character and choose how players will obtain it. You include all rewards from previous tiers. So, pledge $500 or more. <clears throat> traveler, become a part of the game as an NPC, either a traveling vendor or a traveler in peril that your player will have to rescue. So, it may give us a little glimpse into what some of the quests, like almost side quests or things that we'll see in the game. Maybe there will be NPCs that you have to save and all that. We know we'll have traveling vendors now, thanks to this pledge tier. Okay, so, you can choose the name, outfit, inventory of the NPC, um, and includes everything from the previous thing, plus you get tra uh, Traveler as the in-game title. Now, if you pledge a thousand bucks or more, there's already two people that are pledging a thousand bucks or more. You become a, So, become a part of the main story as a rival trainer, and that player has to fight. And that, uh, that the player has to fight. You can choose the name, outfit, inventory, includes all previous tiers as well. Now, if you pledge $2,000 or more, and there's only 10 of these, and one person's already got it, um, one of the 10, become immortal and receive your unique monument in the game with your name and design. Receive a handcrafted guide on how to build your real-life house inside the world of Anatons. Design a skill set for an Anaton. And pledge is, unlimited, or pledge is limited, so you get monument, Handcrafted instruction, uh, design skill set, and the in-game title immortal alongside with all other previous tier rewards. So, there's still 5 of 5 left on the adventure. Design your own Anaton that will be added to the game. Work with the devs from concept art to fully playable Anaton. Pledge is limited. Includes everything before. So again, you're getting, this is freaking sick. Now, if you pledge 7,000 or more, there's only 3 of these guys. You get a you uh, are a legend. Design a side quest and become a quest giver. So we will have many side quests. Write an origin story of your favorite Anaton. Your in-game name will always be displayed in a special legendary color. Your name will be added to the legendary Anaton lore. Pledge is limited. Uh, includes all previous tiers re tier rewards as well. So design a side quest, become a quest giver, write an origin story. Um, your name always will be displayed in a special color. Your name inside Legendary Anaton Lore and the in-game title Legend. And that's all of the tiers. So, that's, you know, if you want to get the game, you have to pledge $30 or more. So, let's go back to me reading all this stuff. But, if you're interested, go ahead. Um, I'm going to have the link in the description below, but I'm going to keep talking. I'm going to try to get through this. This is a very long Kickstarter thing, but I'm going to try to bam, 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 you know, just get through it. So, let me see where I was. Story. World of Antons is divided into smaller areas that are inhabited uh, by different kinds of monsters. Volcanic grounds, you can find various fire types. Uh, you know, um, right now, something's messing up in the real world. Okay. And if you are looking for crystal types, you should visit the underground. Monster infested caves. As a player, you can freely explore. And return to your base at any time. So, Anaton types. There are nine different Anatons. Types of Anatons, rather. Each type has its own unique play style and skill set. You can choose nature for its ability to heal, or stick with the rock for its defensive stick, uh, skills. If, on the other hand, you're going to fight a whole bunch of enemies at once, fire with an area effect skills might be perfect for you. If you're playing with a friend, choose a combination that will increase your damage output, like water and electric. The dual typed Anatons only multiply already almost endless possibilities. Find your place. Also, you have fire, water, nature, rock, ice, electric, wind, crystal, toxic. <laughs> uh, all those look pretty cool. Sound pretty cool. So you start out by visiting your uncle that lives overseas in search of a job. 
trying to go down. You decide to help him to finish his project of a lifetime. Gather information about every existing Anaton. Little you know that this goal will change your life. Not only, ha uh, not only you have to, not only do you have to build your own base, but also collect every Anaton out there, even with the help of your friends. That might take a while. Enough about the task. Which one of these little fellows would you choose? So there's their starters. They're pretty cool. I think if I had to choose, I might choose the one on the left. Although I like the one on the right also. I probably would get the one on the left, honestly. I have a boss for starter types anyways. So, <laughs> I mean, for fire type starters. Good lord. Um, and it taunts with the creatures living in the world or with humans. Or in the wild, or with humans. You can create your own Enatons that will happily help you with fighting or farming. All of your monster friends have to live somewhere. A cozy farm is perfect for them. Every Anaton loves to play and have his favorite food that the owner must provide. With time, your Anaton your monsters will get experience and will evolve into more powerful forms. During your adventure, we'll meet and collect tons of them. While going into the wild, you can take up to six Anatons with you. They will help you travel, gather resources, and fight. If any of your uh, monsters faint during battle, you will have to take care of him before, after returning to your farm. Each Anaton can learn skills as they evolve, and the last stage can master up to three different abilities. Whilst uh, fighting, the player takes control of the monster. To win, he will have to use both accuracy and a tactic. So here's uh, one of the lines, Stegra, Leave Gron, and Stegarian. I like that. Definitely dinosaur looking kind of stuff. The Stegger line is the most popular three stage evolution. You can evolve your Anaton to more powerful forms with each evolution. You can learn new skills. Since this specific line is a rock nature type, while choosing your, a new ability for your monster, you can either pick support, support of nature abilities or go with the defensive rock skills. So, the Tapatas, which is Tapatas, Frobasa, and Frodawa. I like the last one. That actually looks pretty cool. Uh, is a line composed of toxic type anatons. In the first stage, uh, Tadapas has an additional water typing that the next stage is missing. This means that your Tadapas can have a water ability, but since first form ability is known from the beginning, you have to create a Tapatas, Tapatas, oof, Tadapas, I'm getting screwed up on this, with the exact skill, uh, set, uh, that you're looking for. Using more DNA can boost your chances to get better anatons in creation process. So you have... The Atim line. Uh, so it's different from most other Anaton lines. After getting enough experience to evolve, you can choose this new stage. Since Atim's passive ability is to find random crystals, the evolution you choose will additionally influence its skill. Fister is a more defense-oriented evolution that you'll find blue crystals for. Well, Sharker is a more offensive form that you mostly that will find mostly red crystals. So there's crystals in here. So, I've already read all the rewards, the patronage, the pure trainer, the nobleman, the traveler, you know, and all the way to the legend. So, you can follow them here, and let's see. So, they just talk about the stretch goal, why Kickstarter. Here's your team, Bolo, Adam, Hokloro, uh, Hoklora, uh, Lasik, uh, Sonic, Sebastian, or Kulu, <laughs> Fair, Alphamon, and Jim, Leader Ed for design which go you know check out he uh, his uh youtube channel he's pretty good anyways uh here's the roadmap full release for pc and consoles february 2023 huh. so that's all for actually no it's not all what am i thinking i've still got this to go so let's check out the some more gameplay all right so let's showcase a little bit of the mining using good old mentors's head as a pickaxe The materials you find can be crafted to create various items and maintain your base. Which, speaking of which, we're going to head over to right now. Welcome to our farm, the place where all of our boxed anatons live. This is an area that you will construct with various resources and anatons you find throughout your journey. Each type of Anaton has a unique skill in which they can utilize in both upgrading and maintaining our farm. So we're going to bring our Bella Guide over here to our party just to show you. As a water type, it can aid in growing various crops, which we can then use to feed our Anatons and upgrade them accordingly. Over here we have our power generator being maintained by these little guys. As electric types, this is just one of their abilities.
Now we're gonna head in and oh, what do you know? We got a slacker over here. This is the middle stage of the nature type starter and his behavior as well as stats will be dependent on how you raise him. If you're a lazy tamer, your anatons will be lazy as well. So yeah guys, this is just a small sliver of what the world of anatons will have to offer. Alright, so there's the gameplay, the rest of the gameplay trailer. Um, hey, I'm gonna have the descript I'm gonna have the link in the description below if you want to back this. So let's go up here. I'm gonna reload this. I wanna see the updated um let's see if this is behind up top. I wanna see the updated pledge goal. Remember they just started. Literally just started. So let's see. So they got seven thousand seven hundred and eight. Uh, of their 75,000 goal. So they just got 10%, 45 backers, 29 days to go. They just put this up, guys. So if you are interested in stuff like this, you know, uh, monster taming, arc, things like that, make sure you go and support them because honestly, I, I really want to see them hit some of these goals. Uh, not just, I mean, ideally, I'd like to see them hit all of them because. Having dedicated servers, that'd be freaking awesome. Having new Anatons, like it's tons of Anatons, like a new area, new Anaton, you know, new Anaton champion. You know, on that one, you could ride certain ones. I mean, it's crazy the amount of things that they have for a lot of these stretch goals, and they have tons of them, so they're ready for this. Um, I really want to see this succeed. I'm going to be honest. Um, there's some that I definitely want to see some, you know, succeed. I mean, I'd like for about all monster taming games to succeed. If I'm quite honest, I'd like the monster taming genre, uh, especially for independent games, to explode. And I think that's going to happen with more discontent with Pokemon. To be quite honest, um, but if you want to support this, it's going to be in the description below. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. And retro on.